On behalf of Tyler and Brooke and their families, we want to welcome you all to this celebration, a celebration of love and commitment and a celebration of family and friendship. As friends of family, we're here to share this day with Brooke and Tyler as their friendship is transformed into a loving and lasting relationship. One of the privileges of being a youth pastor is you get to watch your kids grow up, to watch them go away to college, they get jobs, they find somebody uh, that they can settle down with. Brooke and Ashley were part of one of the best groups I've ever had in youth ministry. We were all close and they were always there and faithful to be a part of what was going on. Around this time I began to see Tyler coming around and hanging out a little with Brooke at the church and it quickly became evident that something was special. Brooke and Tyler, as you stand here in the presence of God, he sees all the secrets of your heart. By standing here today, you're saying that you're not taking these vows lightly and that you understand as you stand in front of your friends and your family, the holy covenant that you're making with God. If you keep these vows faithfully, as God asks you to in his word and keep him at the center of your marriage, he will bless it and give you a peace as you establish a home and a life together. Since Brooke and Tyler have lovingly entered into this covenant with God today, in front of these they love, I now pronounce that they are husband and wife together. Tyler, <laughs> you may kiss your bride. Two years, three months, and one day ago, uh, I held Brooke for the first time uh, when she was born. Beginning at an early age, it became very apparent that Brooke was a very caring person. We nicknamed her Mother Hen because she quickly started taking care of her little sister. She took the same care for her friends, for those of you who went to school with her and come along. Brooke's always had a sense of love and, and commitment to other people. So today, uh, your friends and family just want to wish you the best, say we love you, and uh, We'll be praying for you. To the bride and groom, thank you very much.